Here's the power of Chinese. I don't read Thai, and the pictures are a bit faded. So. And then all these are Chinese. <gasps> so fast, thank you. For the most incredible meal in Chiang Mai, reserve a table at Cuisine de Garden. The 15-course tasting menu is completely nature-inspired, offering a deep dive into an innovative vision of local ingredients and produce. Chef Nan Lilawat Mankantifan was a furniture designer who became inspired by Copenhagen's renowned Noma restaurant. The entire culinary experience begins right at the minute you exit the car, entering a charming garden with stones that pave a hushed path into a minimalistic setting. The 12-seat restaurant includes an open kitchen, brilliant presentation, and artistic bites. Expect to have every part of your senses be wonderfully surprised. This is by far the best restaurant in Chiang Mai. A nature-inspired concept coincidentally aligns with the current movement on ethical travel in which Cuisine de Garden spearheads by using 100% local produce that narrates stories of farmers and their land. The reduced number of tables in the restaurant was intentional, as Chef Nan wanted to talk to the clients. From the start, he always wanted his team to focus on what they've done best, using food to communicate and educate customers. <laughs> and you can see more of the restaurant in our other video called Cuisine de Garden, Chiang Mai's 15-course tasting menu. Cuisine de Garden was by far my favorite meal in Chiang Mai. It was so delicious, so innovative, so creative, done from the heart and the mind. Everything you would want in high-level restaurant. I feel so lucky that this is my last meal here. The French and Thai fusion is delivered in the most playful and creative manner at Oxygen Dining Room thanks to Chef Alexandre Demar, who comes from a background of Cannes Mediterranean glamour and outstanding caliber. When butter comes in three different flavors alongside an organic egg cow cow mu braised pork leg, you know that Chef Alex likes to mix things up with a whimsical wink. Much of his genius comes from transforming Thai street food's traditional dishes into an imaginative affair, delivered to excite your palate with unpredictability. Sometimes cliché is okay. Dinner at Old Chiang Mai Cultural Center is a true feast since it's the first Kantoki dinner, which is a pedestal tray used as a small dining table by the Lana people. The dinner dance show is truly spectacular with delicious foods while sitting on the floor and admiring folk dances on the stage. <laughs> Expect traditional dishes like Burmese pork curry, green chili paste, minced pork and tomato chili paste, crispy fried pork skin, and so much more. Nova Buri is a hidden Thai cocktail bar serving corky and yummy drinks, while many locals consider this as one of the best cocktail bars in Chiang Mai, intimate and cozy with corky decor. Lamp bays in the form of a squirrel, traditional Thai statues, tried cocktails concocted with Thai ingredients and liquor. On some nights, there's also live music. The service 1921 restaurant is housed inside the former British consulate, now transformed into the Antonara Hotel, which is always a good idea for a fancy meal in a refined romantic setting. Come here if you're nostalgic for a juicy steak and fragrant ravioli paired with delicious cocktails. It's a fancy spot to be, but full of history. In addition to the food and luscious drinks, the interior decor still rings true to its past stemmed from an eccentric British intelligence concept with dark woods and hidden doors that lead to grandiose dining rooms. Here's Mango Steam, <laughs> free time cooking show. Um, and this is how you eat it. It's one of my favorite fruits. Crack it with their fist and looks like cloves of garlic. 
Mmm. <laughs> Yum. Inside the cozy Green Tiger Hotel, Reform Cafe is a vegetarian restaurant that serves Thai and European dishes. The ambiance is extremely relaxing and zen. Large trees and even frogs surround the outdoor courtyard. Dive into Thai specialties, fresh garden salads, fruit juices, smoothies, and coffee. Reform Cafe uses locally sourced organic or pesticide-free ingredients whenever possible. Freebird is a cafe with a cause and offers a fantastic array of organic options from food, smoothies, juices, coffees, and desserts. We love it because the cafe supports Thai Freedom House, which gives back to a community language and arts program for refugees. I'm so happy. I just got some durian. It's one of my favorite things to eat. I know, stinky, but so good. For fresh fruits and vegetables, check out the Wawaro Market. There's not a better way to taste what the locals truly eat from what they buy at local markets. From street foods, tasty snacks, to fresh durian and mango steens, you've got to stroll through Wawaro and fill up your tummy.